Good day, everyone. You are welcome to today's tutorial. My name is Peter Emanj Adaviruku. Uh, I am a GIS service provider. I offer services in installation, training, data acquisition, data integration, and data analysis. Today, I want to show you how to select features in QGIS. How to select features in QGIS. Remember to subscribe to my channel. Now, let's go to the QGIS. So, this is QGIS interface after launching. Now, let's add data, vector data. Click on vector, add vector data. Navigate to your folder. And in this example, I want to add Kogi State shape file. Let's locate our folder. It's in Nigeria shape file. Nigeria shape file. So, let's go to Kogi State shape file and i want to select kogi state lga and kogi state towns kogi state towns kogi state town click on open click on add and close so the two layers has been added so now let's say Double click on this, go to label. Click on this, click label. You are labeling with the field called name and you click on OK. OK, it has been applied. So now let's say you want to select few out of these local governments we have. We are not interested in the whole thing. So how do we go about that? There are different options. Now you come to this place. You click here, you have select features, you have select features by polygon, you have select features by freehand, select features by radius, whichever uh, options you want to use. Depending on the arrangement of your tools, the option is also here. This is also the options, depending on how you arrange your tools. Now, in this case, we want to use select features. So after clicking on select features, you come back here, you click on the one you want to select. In this case, we want to select this, so it has been selected. If we want to select more local governments, you press Control key and click on the next one you want. Click on the next one you want. Click on the next one, uh, sorry, on the next one you want. And click on, let's say we, are, we want this as well. So you've selected all the local governments of your interest. Now, how do you now use it to create a layer to be on its own? To do that, you come back to this that very layer. You right click and go to exports. Then you click on save selected features as. Click on that. Then navigate to the folder where you want to save it. In this case, I want to save it in my desk on my desktop in a folder named tutorial. So let me call this Kogi underscore central one underscore central one you click on save then you check add save file to map and click on ok so the new thing has been added so this is the area we have selected so you can now zoom this to layer and you can double click it and go to labels then click here and click on single label and click on OK. So you've been able to select about five local government, Okehi, Adave, Ajakuta, Okene, and Ogorimagogo. So this is how to select features in QGIS. But now, let's say we want to select features from points. We want to select features. There are many options on how to do that. Now, another way to do that, maybe you are, let's double click this, go to label, uh, single label, and click on OK. So, all the towns has been, has been labeled. Now, let's say you are interested just in one of them, not in all. So, you can come here, select multiple, uh, multiple selection by points. You can use that. There are many options are there. You can use any. So you click on that. Click on the point you are interested in. So 
it has been highlighted in yellow so you have been able to select that very point another way of doing that is to go to the attribute table of the very uh, layer you are interested in so that when you click here you have selected that so that's uh, another way you can select through attribute table whichever method is convenient for you so this is how to select please remember to subscribe to my channel once again thank you for watching this video